ethylene dibromide, a very toxic pesticide, which caused a great deal of concern a few years ago. Not only were workers unprotected, but also the community. EDB found its way into much of what we ate and drank. EDB is a perfect example of the limits of regulation and why the public, workers, the community should be vigilant at all times and should be aware of possible health problems, of race problems, of, of uh, the limits of, of the government to really regulate things. Um, we knew about EDB 10 years ago. In 1974, the National Cancer Institute came out with very conclusive data about the, the cancer-causing potential of EDB. Yet nothing happened. No regulation was uh, affected, and it was continued to be used. Many, many thousands of workers all over the country were exposed to it. We as consumers ate EDB in bread, in, in, uh, in biscuits. Um, it's in, it was used in breweries. It was used in flour mills. Um, it was used in homes for structural pest use. None of us were aware of it. The government knew and the industry and the industry knew that EDB can cause cancer and, and very powerful reproductive effects in men. Um, industry opposition and government resistance kept EDB, a very, very potent toxic pesticide, unregulated until 1982.